In the previous episode, the Bitter Draft Companion died in combat. We reached Plan Tier 1, joined the Southern Empire as a mercenary, had to sacrifice troops several times, and made good money from completing quests. Let's head back. We need to recruit some people. I think that's going to be the next priority. Let's not do another escort merchant caravan. I kind of want to do something else. We got outriders. It's going to be... I don't know. Do we want horse archers? I want to get some melee troops. I want to find more of these hired spear. Or actually the, the maceman would be more appropriate because when they upgrade, they'll not be useless. Even more escort merchant caravan. Mercenary maceman. These are the high tier. They're tier five. They're really expensive and definitely not at all worth it. So we're probably going to lose troops no i guess not let's go visit a few places see if we can pick up quests and also finding troops to hire all right so we'll pick up another brigand quest sword sisters we'll take the sword sister one that's fine we need to do the brigand quest so i don't want to be slowed down by anything 2400 so we'll make good money there we need to stock up on food again though i think five for now is fine 29 on 30 we're actually right there so we have enough mounts all right, let's see what else. I think also the salt. Does this place have it? No, that one needs tools. Uh, I was supposed to be doing help with brigands around Chinopsis. Why did I leave Chinopsis? Whoops. Yeah, let's go back up there. Oh, I was trying to find troops. That's why. Yeah, if we can find a few more. I think those are the tier four. Yeah, those are tier four. I would love it if they were cell swords instead, but we're not going to have that option and we do want troops. So we'll take them. There's no way I'm paying 400 for a spare mount so that's not gonna happen all right here we go let's just take these guys out real quick nice another little group and i don't care for sharing it because we just want to clear the quest anyways there we go all right if we can oh wow yeah look at that our expenses went up a lot it's because of these they're so expensive man they're so expensive 18 wage it's insane regular troop tier 5 or only 12 wage but these mercenaries are 18 wage. They're not only more expensive to hire, but they're more expensive to maintain and they're worse in combat. There we go. We'll definitely take that. This guy seems pretty good in combat. We can take him. All right, no horse. We'll give you a shield and feed you to the wolves. They're so useless for 18 dinars, but that's part of the challenge. We're not able to do a lot of stuff that I would normally recommend doing, like fighting solo and just stacking up cash. So you have a couple hundred grand and then hiring a real army rather than doing this slow progression. We got to take those escort merchant caravan quests just because the enemies that you fight based off of it are going to be really nice. It'll give us a lot of influence. Yeah, let's do escort merchant caravan again. Ooh, sell swords. We'll take them. They're low tier. We don't have a whole lot of money to spare. Oh, nice. And actually, we do have a pretty healthy amount of melee troops now. So what I'm going to do is let's go loose formation. Keep them on the hill. Melee troops will get up there nice and close. We'll go shield wall and keep them stationary so they can trap the cav when they try and charge them. Like this guy, they just completely stop and then they get dumped on. We want them to hit the formation and then just get completely stuck. All right, they seem to be bypassing. Let's actually get our melee troops up here and we can help. All right, veteran sword sister. One of them died. I don't mind that. They're really expensive and I kind of want them to be cold. They seem to be only targeting our archers. Let's get our melee troops inside the range and then they should be able to deal some damage. Ideally, we'd keep them all in a tight formation, but they still have a decent amount of horse archers, which is not good. All right, so we lost another veteran sword sister. So that's 36 dinars and wages we just don't have to pay now. <laughs> and we get really good medicine XP because they're the high tier. All right, I think we're holding pretty well. We're taking a few losses, but you know, there's not much we can do about it. Let's speed this up a little bit. Man, they are taking a lot of people out, but we need the medicine XP anyways. All right. Oh yeah, we can bait this guy in. Nice. He wants a piece. He wants a piece of Dimitri the lover. Oh, you got a piece of something. There we go. All right, so four losses, mostly the troops that we don't want anyways. So the Sword Sister, that's the tier four. I'd rather have all tier three if we can, if we can help it, that'd be ideal. So this is actually not a bad thing. And it's gonna give us more medicine XP, almost 10 influence, it's pretty good. That's a lot of money. Oh, nice. That's what I wanted to see. So the low tier Sword Sisters. I'm trying to figure out why our money went that low. I thought we had a bit more. Did I spend it on something? Also, we don't need this many Sumter horses. So let's clear that out. So just go to 20. That'll give us plenty of room when we start losing people again. We need more middle and Paul free, but we don't have cash to do that. So yeah, I'm trying to figure out what the heck is gobbling up all our money. I know our wages are pretty high. Is it really that high? Seven. 
I don't want to just throw them out because we could get XP for them when they die. All right, where's this ambush? Let's actually get ahead of the ambush and fight it separately so that I don't want that group being drawn in. There's only three left. I don't want to lose the mission. One thing we could do to limit casualties is we could... Oh, that might be funny, actually. All right, we're going to do it. We're going to sit up back here and hopefully some of them run off the cliff. That'd be pretty funny. Oh, he did it. <laughs> yeah, some of them are going to run off. This isn't the one that's really high up, though. All right, they're getting stuck over here, so let's get our melee troops over here. They're just sitting ducks. This is going to be really easy. Oh, wow. Dimitri the lover, man. You got to put in some work. We're getting pushed around here. Maybe we'll get back on a horse or something. Oh, somebody else fell down. I saw him. Yeah, there's somebody else down there. Oh, he's going to go for sure. Oh, I was going to say he's definitely going down. All right, let's pull our melee troops back because they're getting a little wide. I wanted to see if we'd get any of them to dive off of it themselves, but now they're just going to be stuck down there a bit. All right, let's charge them in again. Oh, nice. We can catch some of them. Yeah, you guys are toast. Oh, three of them. Yeah, you're not going anywhere. Good old body block. All right, let's pull the troops back again so they don't get too far out. Let's move away and let them come up because they're stuck down there. If we get far enough away, I think they'll come back up. Actually, let's just give our infantry a charge command. I don't really care what they do. There's only a couple horse archers anyways, so... If they're chasing, that means their shield's facing the right direction at the very least. It's fine. And hopefully they draw some, some fire from these guys instead of our archers. All right, this was a pretty good battle. We lost a few people. Cell sword, mercenary macemen. Unfortunately, we didn't lose the Sword Sister veteran. This was a big battle. I didn't realize it was that many. So pretty good, maybe 12? Yeah, we got 12 influence. That's going to pay off a lot. And then prisoner-wise, again, we're going to try and find a place to drop them all off because we're going to need it. Actually, let's see if there's anything along the way. Oh, yeah, there's one. Please be it. No, it's not the right one. Draft animals. We need to find... Man, we're so strapped for cash. It's kind of stressful. Oh, man, they got another one. Don't die, don't die. And it doesn't pull this guy in. I was hoping it would, actually. We could just auto-resolve it. But... It's all right. 39, we'll have a pretty good fight here. And I'm just going to charge my infantry on shield wall and see if they do okay like that. I'm going to group my archers up a little bit and loose formation, see if that helps them. Maybe if they're tighter together, they'll do better. All right, the boar got destroyed. Oh, we're losing a lot. Oh, nice. The veteran sword sister. We got one dead. We're farming that medicine. That's what we're doing here. We're farming medicine. We need to get rid of people anyways. Our wages are way too high. We don't have the ability to pay for them. Wow. We actually cleared them out pretty fast. That was a lot. Yeah, we only lost those three. That's fine. Another 12 influence. We'll put the final point into leadership. So we're capped. These are the four core skills that we want to do. We'll probably do a little bit of trade. Definitely do engineering, but we're not sieging anytime soon. So maybe we'll do tactics at some point. I wouldn't even mind putting some points into roguery just for the battle loot. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Hopefully they don't get caught. Don't get caught, dude. Oh, you got caught. I'm just going to auto resolve this because that looks really annoying to fight. Uh, we lost somebody again. Seriously. All right. We got some tier two troops. Let's get rid of them. Take the prisoners from the tier three. Oh, the hat looks nice. Oh, there we go. Dimitri the lover looking fly. Dude, that's such a cool looking hat for him too. Can you imagine him like as a pickup artist? He's just going into the bar like this. <laughs> so what do you think of my cool hat? All right. Let's see what we got here. Plus 10 recovery after each battle. I don't think it really matters. It doesn't really matter. That perk's not that important. Oh, I want to check this out. Uh, he's going to go back. I got to check it out, though. If he gets captured, that's fine. Tools. Are you serious? We don't want to give you tools. Did he go in here? Oh, he went in here. I guess he didn't go in there. Whoops. All right, whatever. Uh, there's a clay pit up here we can check. We want to find a place to turn that quest in. 37 raiders. Oh, wow. Oh, you know, he must have got captured by that. That's a big group of raiders. Draft animals again. Jeez. Well, if we don't find it soon, we're going to run out of cash. Uh, we need to pick up another quest because we're going to just flat out run out of money here soon. I think it might make sense to fire these just to reduce our wages. Maybe we'll wait until we're desperate. But yeah, it's we're kind of close to being desperate. We need to get a good quest soon or we're going to be losing money. All right, 18 is pretty good if we can catch them. And I know we're chasing pretty far, but we need to head this way anyways. Can we lose somebody? Nice. Veteran Sword Sister. We lost another one. <laughs> We're rooting for them to die. All right, let's just get rid of these looters. Bandit base. Art of the trade. Again, dude. Somebody give me that quest, please. We need it. Mechalavea is the next closest. 
All right, we got to be careful. We're heading up into enemy territory. Oh, they got a quest. All right, I really hope this is it. Manual labors, we got it. All right, so we're saved. We're good on money. Mind your own business. We're going to get at least eight or nine K here. Yeah, nine K. Beautiful. All right, so money wise, we're good for a while. So we could do discarded weapons or party morale. Party morale is pretty much pointless. Let's go discarded weapons. At least we'll have one way of leveling troops up fast if we need to. So if you look at our party wage, it's 565 a day. We have no way of earning any money. It seems like we have money, but it burns really fast. We need to save up a nice little nest egg and then we can afford to, you know, take people. We got to buy some more food here. We're starting to run low. I got to do a better job of doing that because Steward is going to be one of our main focuses here. Actually, we got a perk. And then this one, travel speed with higher party morale. We're almost there. I would like to start raiding some villages because that's a really easy way to stack up influence. And it's fairly low risk. Not raiding, but at least taking out the militia, I mean. So we'll force them to give us goods. Oh, they didn't even put up a fight. Nice. Dimitri the Lover is also a bandit. All right, we don't want to go anywhere near that. This is being sieged. I don't know if it's us. I don't think it is. No, it's... So they're at war with two people now. Oh, look at that. The hidden hand. They're trash. If we can get this fight, I would love to do it. I think we can do it. You are loot pinatas. Oh, look, they got sword sisters as well. I think our sword sisters are better than your sword sisters. So for sure, we're just going to sit back and pick at them until they get tired of getting shot at. I suspect they're going to have a pretty effective shield wall here. So we'll get a couple of volleys off and see if we can get some damage in, but we might want to split into two groups. Yeah, so we're still getting hit. All right, let's do this. Let's reposition ourselves a little bit. See if we can get a little better flank here. So we'll move our infantry there to hopefully keep their attention this way, and then we can get around their flank. Nope, they're going to move. So we need to move our infantry as well. If they charge, oh, they're not going to charge. Well, at least we can take out that sword sister. There we go. Yeah, take that useless pile of garbage out. Oh, nice. They're separating their militia out. This is going to seem counterintuitive, but we have to fight together. We need our sword sisters in melee. Otherwise, we're going to get creamed right here. So we'll pull them back. Let's go shield wall. Sword sisters. Once they're in, we line formation and charge everybody. We just want to have a critical mass that they can't even get attacks off because we have too many troops. The sword sisters aren't going to get too many shots off in the back because they're blocked. Might as well let them do their job. They do okay in melee. They're not terrible, I guess, as long as they don't get hit in the head. But that worked out pretty well. Only lost two. We fought mostly in melee range. So I would say that's a pretty successful fight. All right. You are a prisoner, I think. Or do we let him go? I don't really want to go back to drop him off. So let's just let him go. Level up our charm doing that. So we might as well. We got prisoners we can sell. We got lots of good loot. Everybody's got lots of loot. Yeah, look at that. Our little ragtag band. Actually, how many people can we... So we're maxed out on companions. Yeah, we, I'd like to keep that maxed and hire as many as we can. Now this one, 100%, it's got to go Warlord. This is like one of the best perks that you can get in the early game when you're a mercenary. Really, really important. So plus 30 influence from any battle we fight. So if we're making 100 influence per... Oh, they chopped our freaking thing way... It's down... We're only making 70 dinars per influence now. Come on, Rege, you can't do me dirty like that. That's the problem, right? If they know you want them, they can do whatever they want. <laughs> the simping thing went bad on us. All right, give us the goods. They want to fight for it, so we'll fight them for it. They are yeah, going to charge us. Well, that makes life so much easier for us. We'll go nice and wide with our line because we don't have to worry about getting flanked here. Tighten that up a little bit and move them up so that we're blocking as little line of fire for these guys as possible. Or these ladies. And as soon as they hit line formation charge, I gave their charge command of the wrong unit. That's my bad. Yeah, it cost us a couple units. Oops. We should not be losing units to militia. So sword. Yeah, I didn't want to. I don't want to lose the two or three units. But we got leadership 75, so we'll get another perk there. Decrease taken range damage. Yeah, we'll use that. Now I don't want to be around here while we have the movement debuff. Let's go back to Epicrodia. We'll sell. Oh, nice. Party wages 540. We can take on a little bit more. Yeah, it's scary. I don't like doing it, but we kind of have to at this point. We need troops to make the money, essentially. So let's get rid of all this stuff. We're making okay money. We're not in bad shape. We'll take another horse too. What do we got here? Party leader plus five. Yeah, we're going to definitely take the party size increase. 37, but it's going to be mostly cavalry. So it's kind of scary. Let's see what they have. Oh, it's not mostly cavalry, actually. We can fight this if we can catch him. Yeah, we're faster. 
I'm gonna wait till daytime because it's really hard to see. This is pretty interesting tactics wise if they push into us, but I don't think that's what's gonna happen. They have a single archer and it's a sword sister. So let's go and slaughter her real quick. We can speed it up a little bit. All right, I'm gonna actually give the charge command with the archers too. They might need to get in here because their infantry are pretty strong. Yeah, our infantry are not doing well here at all. All right, now we need to pull back because we destroyed most of them. And we need to go shield wall nice and tight. Oh, you got him, didn't you? Yeah, you did. You bastard. So we lost some of the expensive melee troops. That's fine. I guess that at this point in the campaign, I wouldn't mind having all tier two and tier three just because I still feel like I'm fairly effective with them, but they're not going to bankrupt us. Yeah, we're really struggling to stop these guys. What the heck? There we go. Oh, but he turned around. Oh, come on. Why are they not getting stopped? There we go. This is so painful to watch, man. These mercenary troops are so bad. Okay, so we're having trouble with them not getting stopped. And I'm not sure why. You know what I'm going to do, actually? Let's combine everybody into one group. And let's just shield wall. Everybody's going to be really tightly packed. Maybe that'll make a difference. There we go. We got one. All right, let's go wide. Oh, come on, come on. It's so annoying. Oh, somebody beamed him. All right, there we go. So we lost only five. That was actually really good. I don't mind the mercenary masonry getting lost. Sword Sisters of the tier four as well. So we're losing high tier, which is actually good for us. We get more medicine and all that. Now we'll let this guy go. Like I said, we want the charm XP. We got nine levels off of that. It's pretty good. Only 2,700. That's not that much. I thought we'd be making more money than that. Let's let our companions heal up for a sec. They're at least on their feet. Let's go with that. I think what's happening here is these big armies are probably drawing a lot of their big parties. So we should be able to come over here and just raid everything. And that's an easy way for us to earn influence. And actually what I'm going to do here is let's actually hold these guys so they don't have a flank. And I'm hoping they just attack the infantry. And then we'll have an easy flank on the shield wall. Yeah, exactly like that. Except for that one guy. I don't know what he's doing, but he's going to get smashed. So we'll get an easy flank on him from the archers. Our foot troops won't fight as effectively, but... Yeah, it's pretty much over. Let's just speed it up. GG. Yeah, didn't lose anybody. 6.5 influence. Like I said, we just need enough to pay for our troops. Nice. I actually got some upgrades from the from the militia. Okay, let's go further north. Oh wow, look at this. They took one, two. They took a lot. They took from Batania. They took from Sturgia. And I think this was originally Western Empire, if I'm not mistaken. So they took from them. They're taking from everybody. Well, we'll have to do something to keep him in check later, but for now, there's not much we can do about it. Let's go raid this. All right, this would be a good battle. There's a lot of people here. All right, again, they're going to come into us. We have a huge advantage in, in ranged troops. So what I'm going to do here is let's slide left so we can try and deal with most of their archers before their melee troops get into range. So we're just going to kind of slide around. And also, we'll put the main line in shield wall. These guys are already in their formation. And let's try and slow these guys down. We can distract them as best we can. Keep them from hitting our line right away. We don't need to do too much distraction here. It's more just trying to preserve the troops that we have. I mean, we're going to win this, no problem. But if we can do it without losing too many, it's even better. All right, line formation. Let's go ahead and get in there. Melee troops can get in there, no big deal. I think they don't have enough here to really do much melee-wise. Once they get in range, they're going to get smacked. So I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, they're collapsing. Let's do a general charge. We'll do the Sunza, and we should be good. All right, there we go. So 46, pretty good. Almost 10 influence, and there's very low risk. We only had one injury. All right, we got another level, and now we got to figure out what to put this in. It feels bad to put points into trading, to be honest, but this one's pretty good, too, if we're going to do mercenary troops. Minus 25%, you get another minus 25 up here. So minus 50 for them is pretty good even though the units aren't that good. Yeah, let's just do trading. Oh, that's a big army. Yeah, we don't want anything to do with that. We don't want to fight rag and bad because we'll get smashed. If they're sending armies over here, that means they're probably going to get stomped over here. Taking tile. Okay, so there's nothing around there. Why are we even at war with these guys? It doesn't even make sense. They're so far away. So they took tile, which is completely isolated and it's the wrong culture. So it's, I mean, that's such a waste of time. Come on, Regea. I'm simping, but you're pretty dumb. Let's take these Best little groups. All right, four influence is fine. Money-wise, we're still doing okay. We're not 
making a whole lot though. We're kind of just treading water at this point and that's not a good thing. I do want to keep progressing. But one thing that I want to do is besides selling loot, I really want to get enough horses so that everybody's on a mount. We need to be moving as fast as we can. It's going to be really important. So Tyal, she granted to somebody who cares. So we'll take this quest and then let's go see if we can find a escort merchant caravan quest. And then we can go back there to turn them in right away. That'll be another 10 grand. That will make a huge difference. But these actually, now that I think about it, the Elefteroi are the ones that don't have the shield. All right, let's take control manually and narrow this guy down. Are we faster? No, he's way faster. Yeah, so we definitely have to do this manually. All right, we got him. Are they going to charge? We got to be pretty careful here. This is kind of a risky fight, actually. I know we outnumber them by a lot, but we're going to go shield wall. We're going to get a lot more done in shield wall than we would if we're shooting at him. No question about it. Oh, point blank, just blasting them. Now, what I'm going to do is move these melee troops back so that they're connected. Yeah, we just want to have a big mass of units, and that should help against these cav. Go get stuck in the ball. No, you're not getting stuck, are you? All right, let's go ahead and provide a little bit of protection for these guys because they have some pretty pretty beefy cav. Take some of the sting off of the charge. All right, there's another one down. The problem is we don't have units that have pole arms. If we had pole arms, this would be a trivial battle. The problem is pole arms on mercenary are really bad because they're pikes, and those units are bad against anything other than cav. Are they going to keep charging in? Because we need to deal with these archers. Yeah, we are losing a lot of people. Mostly injuries, though. Let's actually deal with them now. We're starting to get hit pretty hard. Yeah, the problem is as soon as we unfurl, you see how they start picking us off easily. That's why I was trying to avoid doing that, but their archers are being kind of annoying. All right, we can probably mitigate some of the damage just by blocking. That'll help a little bit. All right, come on, get that last archer, please. All right, got it. Back to shield wall. Yeah, if you're fighting against mostly cav and you have a lot of archers, you can still counter the cav by doing this. It's still doable. If we had a five or 400 unit army, this would be... No problem. You know, right now we're just kind of dealing with it. Oh, crap. Is that a cons guard? That's a cons guard. That's not good. We're going to get smacked every time that cons guard comes by. So let's... Yeah, hopefully we can get shots off on him. Oh, man. That cons guard killed like three people. All by themselves. So we lost a veteran. We lost two of the tier fours. And we lost six of the ones that we didn't want to lose. Yeah, we filtered out some of the higher tier. That was a very costly battle. So we'll let him go. 10 levels of charm. Let's change out some weapons here. Or not change out, but we'll add in. Oh, no, no, no. We're going to sell that mace. You ain't getting that mace. If it was a kind of a crappy mace, then we would probably just sell it. 1900. That's a lot. We are out of olives still. Yeah, only olives. We need to go find some of that and also some grapes at some point. So charm. This one is... We'll probably go for double persuasion success but it doesn't i don't think it makes a big difference either way we need to find bandits so preferably we find escort merchant caravan sword sisters is a tier four we're trying to filter down to tier three yeah it's a tier four no you know we're fine let's stack up some cash for a little bit let's spend some time doing that manual labors so we got two of these now actually let's take these out these are kind of easy XP. All right, putting them in loose means they can shoot through each other's formations. So you won't ever block your formations if you put them in loose. You don't need them in line or shield until they're close. Sometimes you can just leave them like that. Nice. Five influence for a battle like that is a no-brainer. And we do need those for the quest, so we'll take them. Hopefully we can get a merchant caravan. The only problem with that is they may try and take us into enemy territory. But if not, we'll have a backup plan. Let's just start taking these guys out. I think we can auto-resolve this. Six looters wouldn't even get close if that was a real battle. Let's take these guys out. All right, there we go. Hired spears. I don't remember these guys. They're tier three and they will also go up to... Yeah, you know, let's get the hired spears. These seem like pretty legit units. They'll give us the protection against cav that we need. And then we can also turn them into different units later. Now, what was I supposed to get? Olives. Yes, we got olives. Now we have money... Don't want to spend 400 for a Midlands Palfrey, but we're going to do it. So we need 14. We need four more to do this quest. Caravan Ambush. We could do that one, though. Yeah, we'll definitely help with this one. 
Now they're gonna start getting a little crazy with the calves. Let's pack it in tighter. And what I'm gonna do, I'm actually, yeah, these are kind of boring to watch, so let's speed this one up. They're getting actually creamed as well. Yeah, we do a little, get out of here. Yeah, we didn't lose anybody, nice. Spears got four kills, that's not bad. All right, these guys are worth a lot, so for sure we'll turn them in. All right, let's go turn that in. And then we have another landowner needs troops down south. We can do that one as well. Only 2,400, man, you guys cheaped out. Our money is really in a good spot right now. As long as we don't hire too many high tier troops, I think we'll be in good shape. Let's take this quest, 14 prisoners. So let's head back this way and hopefully we can find some quests that'll help us out. Let's just send them in, whatever. What do we lose, a sword sister? Yeah, that sucks. All right, that's good. We're keeping a good pace in our Stuart. We're leveling it up pretty nicely. Medicine is slow, but we're gonna get a big jump when we hit 75. All right, you know, we'll take the army of poachers. Let's do it. It's almost nighttime anyway, so we won't have to wait for it. Yeah, we don't want to negotiate. We want prisoners and we want loot. Right, these guys are just getting smashed. Absolutely getting smashed. We're not going to lose anybody, I think. All right, beautiful. We'll take it. I don't know if we can use these guys. I don't know if they're counted as bandits or not, but we'll try and turn them in. We need 14, so we still need two more. We should be able to get it from here. We'll just turn Wait, it in. No, no. We're not getting the, the high value. Oh, there's 13. I don't think we can catch them, though. 5.3, yeah, he's way too fast. All right, 5.1. So let's go turn this quest in, just be done with it. I don't want to fail it. Why are you so slow? Oh, interesting, it's a raider. <laughs> he wants to fight. Yeah, he's that guy's got balls, man. I wonder why he was so slowed down. Maybe he had a lot of pack animals or something. Uh-oh. Garios, that's not good. Well, sounds like you need to stop messing around. Oh, they lost it back to... Wow, that's so sad. They lost the fief back to Sturgia. Like, Sturgia's in wars on two different fronts, and they couldn't manage to hold it. That's pretty bad. All right, hopefully we can turn in everybody. It may not let us, though. Okay, it does. So we're good. We'll get the money. It's not going to be that much. 885? Are you kidding me? You are such a cheap bastard. <laughs> Why did we even do that? It cost us more money to walk down here to turn it in than we got out of that. That's crazy.